Hello everybody and welcome back to today's video. Today we are doing our final YMAP tutorial for a little bit. I think I've done enough of these where you get the hang of how to install them, but I did want to showcase this one which is a new resource that was released about a day ago by the time I'm watching this. Um, and I guess redoes the uh, flight airport thing of Sandy Shores. Clearly I am tired. This is my sixth video recording of the day, so I'm a little tired. I do apologize for the less content of 5M this week. I am working on a Essentials Mode video. Um, it's taking a little bit longer than I expected to get it working and create the video. I want to make sure I get every step correct, so when you're setting it up yourself, you don't have to go through all of the mistakes and problems I went through trying to get it set up. So, that is coming. I do promise. Hopefully next week. I can't promise at 100%. Um, but I guess it depends on how busy I am this week and how busy I am be getting to finish it. Um, but more info on that soon. But anyway, today we're going to be checking out this improved Sandy Shore, uh, Shores airfield. It just removes some of the extra clutter around, adds a helipad um, rather than just a ground, and, you know, just makes it a little bit better um, than the default. It doesn't, like, add extra runways or redo any of that. It just removes some of the extra buildings and things that are normally sitting there. So in order to install this, all you have to do is download the RAR file, just like we do in every single one of our videos, and open it up. And this inside of this folder, you can see there is a folder, and then there's another folder with a README file. I always recommend reading the README to see exactly what's been changed and everything. Um, that's just my personal opinion on that. Um, you can open up the folder and inside the folder you see there's a resource underscore Lula file and a stream folder. Now, this is what we're going to do with this. If you already have your resources and then maps folder created, we created this in the last two YMAP tutorial videos. If you haven't done this, I do recommend doing this. It's not required um, for this resource, obviously, because it comes with its own. But if you haven't already, um, you can already just drag Y maps in here. So technically, you can drag all of these map Y maps into our pre-made maps folder we already made in the last video. Or if you are just installing this, you can just drag this overall folder in. Don't rename it or anything; just keep it the same name. And then you're going to go in your server data folder, edit your server.cfg with uh, Notepad or Notepad plus plus. Add ensure or start the name. This one's called S Airfield. Um, SS Airfield, and um, then all you have to do is start your 5M server by double clicking your start.bat file or run.bat file, whatever you use, and you got it going. But you can either install it in its own folder or you can just drag it into the folder you store all your other Y maps in. It's perfectly up to you. Whatever you decide to do, it will work perfectly there. So I'm going to go ahead and launch 5M and join in, and we'll take a look at how it is. Well, unfortunately, when I was trying to get into the game, 5M decides to have an outage and not let me even start the game. This is, yeah, this is just typical. Anyway, um, that's going to be for this video. I'm sorry I can't show off the map I really wanted to, but it will load correctly and we'll get into the game. To make sure it does load correctly, you can open up your console. Just scroll up a little bit and you can see that it started um, the name of the folder that we have. That means you are good to go and the resource has been started on the server. In the next video for 5M, we got a bunch of stuff coming, so make sure to stay tuned for that. Hopefully, I can get through these error messages and actually get into the game. That would be terrific. Um, but, you know, anyway, hopefully you do have a great day. Hopefully, this would help you figure out some other YMAPs type stuff. Um, our other YMAP tutorials are down in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow.